Anyway, I am here, I am back. Castlevania. For Arcade. So this came out roughly around the same time as like the Game Boy one, I think. <laughs> and if you thought that one was kind of cheap, prepare for this. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, so check. Check. That's probably a good balance, right? Okay. Mute. Turn up mixer. So yeah, Castlevania. It's in an arcade. It's got a joystick and stuff, but I'm playing it on the Switch. They released it for that, you know. So yeah, that statue would have hurt me if it fell on me. <laughs> so that's cool. Cool design there. At least the music freaking rocks. Okay, so we're just gonna get a little yellow devil here. Oh. And I'm already dead. <laughs> Anyway, I've been gone a while. Lots happened in that time. Uh, you know, the whole Nickelodeon thing has been trucking along. They announced a new SpongeBob game, which normally I wouldn't care about, but it's being made by Purple Lamp. And published by THQ. Hey, Jazio. How's it going? How's it swinging? Yeah, I'd argue that this is probably, like, the best soundtrack in the series up to this point, and it would be remixed for several other games in the series. And this song's in Smash Brothers Ultimate, so... Gotta love it. Oh, the tree man! Okay, so yeah, the new Spongebob game looks pretty interesting. We didn't see any gameplay, but I like the promise of what's there. Um, what else? Uh, Deltarune Chapter 2 dropped. Been playing that. Pretty good. Like it. Like it a lot. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, there was the whole Direct. Uh, I posted my reaction to the Mario casting. But, the, there's some other cool stuff in there. Act Razor, Act Razor got a remake, which I didn't expect. Uh, fully 3D Kirby game, so that's pretty cool. I had a feeling that was coming sooner or later. Okay. Oh, crap. Medusa. So, originally this game had, like, limited continues. A feature that is mercifully gone here. Doing well aside from uni work drowning me and I got six days to finish fusion. Ugh. So we're in fog town. Okay, so you wanna duck for that. Uh, was there anything else that's happened? Yeah, Freedom Planet got a launch window. Finally got done with uni. Congratulations. Oh yeah, they announced, uh... They announced that, uh... In Nintendo 64 and Genesis were coming to Nintendo Switch Online. You gotta pay extra for it, which I think is an awful value, but... But I mean, I also own most of these games in physical form, so I guess, you know, 
maybe I'm not the best person to ask. Then again, that also means I'm just kind of paying for crappy online, so... Oof. Oh, Merman! Merman! Oh! <laughs> oh yeah, the Nintendo 64 controller's temp thing. I, I do have interest in that. Yeah, so... If I was playing the original arcade release by this point, I would probably have to... I would probably have to start over. Because for some reason, this is an arcade game... <laughs> ...that gave you limited continues. I know, it seems a little backwards, doesn't it? Yeah, the Genesis controller not tempting unless it was Japanese. Yeah, I agree. I would have... I would have preferred if it was the six-button controller, but uh, that's a nice boulder. Oh. <laughs> Level design. But I recently built my own uh, Bluetooth Genesis controller. It took me a little while, but it, it feels pretty good. I've been using it with my uh, retro receiver. Oh, we're going down. Oh. I have no idea where I'm going. Well, I mean, in a straight line, but... I thought you were walking on nothing back there. God, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> oh, speaking of Castlevania, though, uh, Konami is doing some interesting stuff. Oh. So they, they might be reviving this series, there's a rumor, but, you know, I'll believe it when I see it, personally. <laughs> and also, they seem to be calling out to indie devs to make, like, revivals of their games, which is very weird and kind of- I kind of smell a rat. Almost forgot to hit the follow button. Oh, thank you very much. Uh... I don't have... <laughs> I don't have it playing in my head. Wait, hang on. Maybe I can use the audio monitor to do that. Uh, well, it only lets you do audio track. I mean, I could set up another track for... I, I won't do it this time, but I could probably set up a, a track entirely just for the uh, Streamlink thing. Not Streamlink, uh, Streamlabs and have it play in my headphones. Otherwise, I'm not really notified, so I, I'm sorry if I ignore anybody following or anything like that. Okay, so there's gonna be, like, random bat ambush around here. Yep. Yeah, since this has infinite continues, we might actually see the end, but I'm not making any promises. Ugh. Okay, well, this is a graphical decision. Mud man, mud, mud. Which is my name, coincidentally. Okay, we're back here. Ugh. I love that super cartoonish um, boulder sound effect. Donk, donk. <laughs> what are you supposed to do about half of this stuff? You're just supposed to take it like a man, I guess. Oh, no, it's... Ah, ah. Yeah, so this is the Arcade Archives version. I gotta say, uh, big props to Hamster, which is definitely a company name, that for, you know, putting all these games on, you know, new platforms. Because I was thinking, like, when the Switch was coming out, that a lot of arcade games just haven't seen re-releases. So I appreciate... I appreciate the emulations and ports and whatnot. Especially this one, because this is... kind of one of the more obscure Castlevania games, I think. 
besides the stuff on, you know, personal computer. No, no, no. Okay, I'm just, you're just foobard. Okay, so I need to figure out what can be done about the mud man. Yeah, so by now, I would have run out of continues, and I would have been forced to go back. How do I deal with this? Can you deal with that? Has science progressed to that point? <laughs> Always with that bat. Always. Also, that's some good pallet-cycled water down there. Nice purple in it. Doesn't give me a seizure at all. Yeah, so if you thought, like I was saying, if you thought the Game Boy one was kind of cheap, then th that's going to look like the Sistine Chapel compared to this. This is a cheap Castlevania game. I mean, I'm talking about in terms of design decisions, not necessarily money. I mean, though it didn't cost that much. I'll only agree if this gets two streams. Maybe. And we all know the Sistine Chapel is very easy to play. I mean, to a degree. Oh. Oh, okay, well, I don't think the sky should look like that. Oh. <laughs> the piss trees. Okay, so I'm guessing you just want to find the spot. Okay. I was going to say find the spot and duck under it. Screen doesn't scroll while you're jumping. Okay, there's a bat here. Okay, thank you. I would have liked that heart. But you know, platforms are not actually platforms. It's a little known fact, you know. Yep, just heart right into the pit. Maybe I don't need to use it the second time. I needed to use it the second time. Or at least aim better. Jeez. So I, I guess you just want to hit him and then advance or something. Oh, what was that? Oh, uh, I thought I was dead. Oh, merman. Sounded like take on me. Oh, there's ground down there now. Mm, I'm gonna stay up on the piss trees if at all possible. It just feels, it feels safer. Okay, sky is dark. Oh dear, oh dear. No skeleton. We're having a per we're having a personal moment. Is that really their walk cycle? Yes, the skeleton strut, and I love it. Okay, we're back here now. Unlike the Game Boy one, if I don't beat this this stream, I might just not bother. Just to just to let you know. No. You can't get it! The, you cannot get that heart. It cannot be done. Oh, oh, oh no! I had found the secret. Oh. I'm just gonna take a dive in Aquatic Mine real quick. Just gonna put some more quarters in, don't worry. 
How? Oh, I peeked. Uh, maybe I still got my uh, signal clip whatever gain thing to too high. I don't knew. Okay, just fall down, fall down. I didn't mean like that. And it never came back down. Suck it, Newton. <laughs> Okay, I made it. I made it. Like I said, though, it doesn't even do the thing like it where it's pay to win. Where you have to, you know, keep putting in quarters over and over. Because this game gave you limited continues. The, the unlimited continues that I have right now are only because I'm playing the arcade archive version. If I were playing the original, I I would be back at the start of the game. That's just how it is. Oh, 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 no, no. What? Oh, boy. And I'm not going to get any health because... <laughs> the the TCRF page says has a disclaim disclaimer at the top saying we know you're here to see if the game has a second level. Oh, that's great. Well, I can confirm to you that it does. No, this, I want that I want that power up, but it never it never comes back down. It's a shame because I I mostly want to get to the later level so y'all can hear the music because it's really awesome. And like I said, several tracks are remixed for later games. I mean, okay, I'll just tell you, if I don't make it through the game, which is very likely, then definitely look up the soundtrack afterwards. If only, if only once. Because it really is quite good. It does not, it does not deserve to be in a game like this. <laughs> Just stand in the right pixel. Which one is it? We'll never tell. I, I will take the pixel to the grave. Oh, oh, I'm not off the staircase. Okay, so I can use the... I can use the watch here to get past those guys. That being said, it... I don't know how much it helps. <clears throat> yes! Yes, video gaming experience! Okay, let me... let me kill... Mr. Bones here. Oh, I forgot. I forgot, he's a skeleton and a ghost. You know, your two-for-one monster special, it's like a turducken.
Yeah, the skeletons... I mean, the skeletons in the first level don't do this. So, it's even worse because it, you get to this level and suddenly the skeletons have a new trick up their sleeve. They have evolved. It's like Metroid 2, except, you know, Bram Stoker. Mm, yep, wrong pixel. You have chosen incorrectly. Die. And just a reminder, if you would like to play this wonderful game, then it is available on Nintendo Switch, on the Nintendo eShop. It, you can own it right now. <laughs> like I said, I am not... <laughs> I, I want that mace. I want to see what the mace is, but it... <laughs> It slightly goes out of the top of the screen, and then it's just gone forever. Is it Arcade Archive? It's Arcade Archive. It'd be nice if it was included in the Castlevania collection, but no dice. Because I will admit, buying this on its own... Maybe not the, the best bargain in the world. I'm already kind of at a disadvantage this attempt. Oh, I got a heart, I think. Luckily, one one small mercy is that you keep your hearts between attempts. So you can kind of just grind up hearts if you want to, which I may actually do. Like I said, infinite continues in this version. So, the obstacle here is me deciding I don't care anymore. Come on, Mace, Mace, yes! Mace! No! <laughs> Can I keep the mace? Can I keep the mace between lives? <laughs> yes, I do! Yes! Gonna insert some more quarters. Oh, I got the heart. You just have to be insanely quick. So this will help me out significantly in my quest to conquer Haunted Castle. Why on earth did they call it Haunted Castle and not just Castlevania? I don't understand, honestly. I mean, they just kind of played fast and loose with their brands back then. Mm. Oh, oh yeah, good. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, brother. I think it's more powerful, but slightly lower range. Oh yeah, I I vaguely remember the Turbo Graphic Street Fighter port. Oh my God, the boulder! The boulder! Oh, missed. If I get enough hearts, I can probably just cheese my way to the boss. Hmm, pardon me, I know that picked up. <laughs> Fighting Street. 
This game looks pretty ugly. I admit, I, I like the character sprites. Not a huge fan of the environments, though. Environments kind of suck. Oh, you gotta, you gotta hit him twice. More quarter, please. Wait, hang on. Oh, no, I thought, I thought I had a plan. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, screen boundary. Just book it, book it out of here. I think the teal lines are supposed to be fog. Are you supposed to get the high score in this game? Okay, so it's like right about here between the two brown spots Okay. Two brayers <laughs> with a leg in the other hand. And the heart was never seen again. Okay, just ignore skeleton. Skeleton not even worth dealing with. Okay, forgot about sea man. Oh. Okay, well, I'm not doing good in regards to the sea man. Okay, so we're here with some hell. Okay, so can you freeze? <sighs> I will find out some other time. Don't worry, eventually I will memorize the entire level. Ah uh, yes, hearts. Good. Fuel. The fuel of mankind. <laughs> please, haunted castle, please. I'm good. I'm okay. I'm alright. For now. But I will grind mini heart. Okay, I have found the spot. That's okay, I didn't need that heart anyway. Okay, it turns out you don't need to freeze this guy. He's actually pretty easy. Which is all about learning the tactics. The exact way that you need to beat the level in order to succeed in life. At least the bat doesn't do much damage. Compared to Skeleton Johnny over here. Okay, good. 
Is there a third one? I forgot. No, I don't think there's a third one. Okay, now be be weary. Oh, I misused that. And now I am going to pay the price. But you can freeze the boss. You can freeze the boss, which may help me out here. Oh, who am I kidding? It'll definitely help me out. Mm, the boulder! The boulder is my foe. The boulder knows the secrets that I don't want it to know. No oh, bats in the cave. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, all right. And I know how to get past the mud men more or less. Except I got too close to that one and thus I have ruined my entire life. It's not a good feeling when you're playing a game and you're just like, well, I made one mistake. There goes the entire attempt. <clears throat> I think I just made <laughs> Simon's voice clip there, with my own mouth. One hit. <laughs> one, one hit, and that's like half my health bar. Okay, just book it, book it, book it out of there. Oh my god, I can't believe it. The legend is real. The heart is not. <laughs> home is where the heart is, and home is nowhere. At least I can get this tiny heart. Can get an extra one off of this guy, maybe, sometimes. Okay. Maybe we will soon see level two. I mean, level three. Okay, so far so good. This is a pretty good attempt so far. So now that I've said that, I am going to make a mistake post-haste. Well, I mean, that's... That's not the worst mistake one could make. But still, considering that the boss does like 3 million damage... It would probably be best if that didn't happen. We, you gotta love how he just kind of keeps his momentum at the top of the screen when he jumps. Yes! Oh, where are we going? Oh, we're at the castle. Drawbridge going down. Very red. Soaked in the blood of the innocents, perhaps. So there are six stages in this game. Oh, you recognize this song? Oh, Flea Man! Well, okay, this is not going well so far. That chandelier is absolutely gonna fall on me. Yep. 
I thought I could duck and be safe. Oh, axe armor. Yeah, the flea men are always annoying, but they're especially annoying here. Oh. A specter. Oh. I, I went into the mirror dimension. Harpies. Man, man harpies, I think. Oh, dead. I don't know. Is that boob? Is that boob? Is that some titty? Well, I'm sorry. At this was a no, my mace. I got hit too many times. Honestly, I could just grind hearts on the flea men, and that would probably give me a very good advantage. A moment of respite in this game's nonsense. What do you do? What do you do? I can't believe Castlevania is going to get me banned on Twitch. But it, I, you know, it only actually matters if, if it's like an indie game. If you're playing a big name game, well then it, it you know, it doesn't matter. Doesn't make any sense? Screw you. Yes, it's a double standard, but we're Amazon. We don't care. You just have to go whole hog on the flea men there. You cannot make it. You have to... You have to wait. At least the monsters here don't do that much damage. Comparatively. I mean, we know there's a checkpoint somewhere. So, I think my goal now should be using whatever means are possible to get to the checkpoint. Pardon me. Okay, you cannot get past this on the first dip. You gotta get... It's like, I can't get past this because there's flea men up my butthole. Get me out of here. Get, to send me to the mirror dimension. This is honestly kind of freaky. These hitboxes are not in my favor. But why would they be? Why would anything in this forsaken castle be in my favor? Flea man, I'm I I am having a talk with Sir Knight here. Please. No, you know what? I'm freezing. What? What? How, how dare you? I I use the world. God, that scream. I don't like this place. I don't like the mirror Aztec dimension. It, it, it makes me uncomfortable. The, 
Oh, uh, the power of Christ! The power of Christ! Oh, maybe I didn't want that, actually. Because... Destroying time was a good- or, <laughs> yeah, destroying time was a good power. To have in this game. But whatever, I'm rolling with it. Hello, ma'am. How are you? Can I have food? Oh no, the food's- the food's out to kill me, of course it is. Why would meat in a Castlevania game be good for you? But there is a checkpoint. Oh, w wait a minute. What the devil is that? That ain't- that ain't my boomerang. It is pretty good, though. Yeah, since this is an arcade game, we have to ram enemies up your butt to make sure you're not stalling the machine. Okay, this is like the only good way to take out the flea men. Oh, heart. Big heart. No! Is there a checkpoint anywhere in that? I can't tell. This level kind of looks the same. I... I am honest to God shocked that did not hit me. Okay, no. There's the portrait of the bleeding lady. Okay, stairs. You love you love to see stairs in a Castlevania game. It's like it's it's comforting. Oh, torch. No, I I think I'm going. No, no, no. Can there can there be a checkpoint there? I would appreciate if there was a checkpoint there. Of course not. Why would there be? Yeah, I think the best solution would probably be grind hearts and then go like whole hog. There's no candles in this game. God, they're just they're they're infinite with Sega Enterprises. It's you can't. You can't. There's nothing you can do about this. You have to use an item. There's there's no way to take out the booby harpies with with just the whip. I I have to grind. I have to grind hearts from the flea mint. That is the only way I will prevail. Oh wait, I didn't think about ducking those guys. Not that it seemed to help me that time. Yeah, not helping right this moment. Oh wait, no, I'm sorry. This is inaccurate. There you go. See, the problem is, is that they're trying to drain non-existent quarters out of my pocket. You can't! You cannot face the harpies! The harpies are, are indestructible. 
So yeah, I guess I'm just, I'm grinding now. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, the items are the only way to win, so I'm just, I'm grinding. Wish I still had the mace. That would be cool right about now. Okay, let, let us experiment with strategies on the harpies. Your only hope is that they, they duck down low enough for you to jump over them. That's the only hope you have. No! No. Did I rewind? Probably can't rewind. Uh. I think I hit the wrong button. You know what? Wait. <laughs> Speed run. I mean, I got nothing better to do. So we are going on an adventure. Maybe we can grind some hearts this way. Can you like, I mean, they got interrupt save data. Yeah, they got like a temporary save. You can't just save state. Thank, thank you, hamster question mark. I would prefer to have it. Okay, let's see if I can beat Medusa without using any hearts. It's a tall order, I realize, but I want to see if it can be done by me. Okay, she'll move back into you. That's good to know. Just gonna grind up some hearts for the later stages, I guess. Since I have basically memorized the first two. Oh my god, I'm in pain. Oh my god. I am going to drown in a pool of blood because I am going to die. I will be taking that. Come on.
You gotta, you gotta go far enough to trigger. <laughs> we're grinding, we're grinding. We've only been here a little bit. As much as it feels like an eternity. Nah. Nah. I refuse. And you, you can just stay duck. No, I mean, honestly, gr graphically, I'd say this first level looks pretty good, but it does kind of take a nosedive after that. Okay, okay. Gotcha statue. Thank you. Mmm, the good old flashing bricks. Mm, pardon me. I gave in, I used one. I don't know, maybe I should use one against her. The boss is kind of stinky. Okay, cool, cool. Hey, Vida. Uh oh, stinky. Stinky poopy. Okay, how about I get the first few hits in on her? And then I start using the bombs. The kind of... A middle of the road solution. Go eat a shoe! Ah, uh, that guy can't get me. He wishes he could get me. But you can't touch this. I was... How, how, how am I not damaged from that? How did I manage to avoid any damage? Yeah, the, the stage one text gets covered up by the foreground. Gotta love it when old games do that. There you go. <laughs> love, love his little map icon. Oh. Okay, but now we know. Now we know the skeletons have a jump scare. Almost uh, sounds like Skull Kid. If you want me to be honest with you.
which Belmont is that? Uh, this is Simon. It doesn't look like it, but it is. I, I don't know why he has blue hair. And yeah, the background scrolls weirdly. I don't get it. Yeah, like, it looks like it's background, but this is something you stand on. Wait, the boulders weren't there. Weren't there. Yes. Yes. Okay, definitely want this for the boss. <laughs> All right, sure, whatever. I love the bats just everywhere. To just, you know, you can't don't stand around. You're in an arcade, mate. Don't just stand there. Okay, one, two, two whip. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, artichoke. Ow. No, no. No, no! <laughs> Fudge and butts. I'm going to eat a shoe. Yeah, they're, they're only here once you respawn. They're not here the first time. Why did it go on the top? Why? Why did it go on the top? If there's one thing that's even worse than cheap game design, it's inconsistent cheap game design. Alright, okay, yes, that one just spawned on top of me somehow. Ow. Okay, get the knife. I mean the mace. Ow. Flew too close to the sun. My bad. Okay, no mace for me. I'm driving. Okay, can I eke out a win from this? Okay, yeah. So, no mace. Too bad. Okay, progress recovered. Wait, 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 whoa, whoa, no, where'd my hearts go? So they reset per level, but not when I continue? Great! This game sucks! Okay, heart 
flies backwards in direction I was not going. Yeah, you just you just can't dodge them. You just gotta hope you can kill them before then. <laughs> yes, a human being a human being can deal with this. Oh no, I did it again. I'm no. Nah. <laughs> you got to you got to do it quick. You got to do it within like 5 seconds. I'm done. I'm done. I ain't doing that again. And honestly, I'm kind of hungry, so <laughs> I might just stop it there. Look up the soundtrack though. Look up look up a long play. I don't know. It's just like I you got to remember to press the R button. You know, when you <laughs> the R button. To, to simulate the start game button. You got to do that within like three seconds or else the game restarts. I ain't, do, I ain't doing it again. At least not, at least not today. <laughs> Maybe some other time. But either way, that was, that was a, that was a taste of Haunted Castle. <laughs> that was a taste of it. I'll see you guys later.